Hello everyone and welcome back to The Breakdown. Today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to download and install Optifine in Minecraft 1.13 on a Mac. This is a step-by-step -step tutorial. I'm going to show you every single thing that you need to do to get Optifine up and running on your Mac. So, let's go ahead and jump on into it. But first, a message from our sponsor, which is Game Servers. Go to the first link down below, thebreakdown.xyz slash MC server to get an awesome 24-hour DDoS-protected Minecraft server for just $1 per month. We personally love Game Servers ourselves and use them, so go check them out again. That is the first link down below, the breakdown.xyz slash MC server. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and jump on into this tutorial. So the first thing you want to do is go to the second link down below. That's going to take you to this page right here, which is uh, our Optifine tutorial. It'll actually show you how to install Optifine, but what we're looking for is this download button right here. Click the green download button. It takes you off of the Optifine download page. Now, if it says Minecraft 1.13 right here at the top, if it says Minecraft 1.13, all you want to do is come down and click on mirror next to the top version of Minecraft 1.13, right? Right here, just click on the mirror version and you'll be good. Otherwise, if you're watching this video and it doesn't say Minecraft 1.13 there at the top, you want to click on preview versions. Then you want to click mirror next to the 1.13 preview version, right? However, if it says 1.13 down here, you want to come down to the bottom and click mirror under the latest Minecraft version. But for this tutorial, we're using a preview version 1.13 mirror right there. Now you want to find the download link. It's going to just look like some text that's blue most likely, but it's going to say download Optifine 1.13, and that's what you want to click. It's probably going to be in the middle of download buttons, but it's there. Find that and click on it. When you click on it, your Optifine download will begin. Now right here it is in the bottom left. Now this opened up a pop-up on our screen. Just close out of that. There's no worries there. And eventually in the bottom left, Optifine's downloaded. We do want to keep that file. Now we can go ahead and just minimize our browser. I've got Minecraft open already for convenience. But let's go ahead and get Optifine installed. Go to your downloads folder. Should have the .jar file in there. Click on it. Just like that, it's going to say, you need to accept your security preferences. This is an unidentified, develop unidentified developer. We can't open it. Just click OK on that. And then you want to go into system preferences, right? And then you want to find security and privacy. Right here it is. Go ahead and click on that. And then it's going to take us here. Where At the very bottom, you can see Optifine was blocked because it's an unidentified developer. That's fine. We just want to go ahead and click open anyway. You might have to enter your password here for your Mac, but then just go ahead and click open. Now it will go ahead and open up Optifine. It might be in the background, but if you click on it in your dock, there it is. Now all you want to do to get Optifine installed is click the install button right here. Click that. It's going to say Optifine successfully installed. If this doesn't work for you, if Optifine doesn't open, what you need to do is go to the third link down below, and it's going to take you right here. This is our opt or our Java tutorial. It shows you how to download Java. It gives you the Java download link, all that stuff. You need to install Java if you have any problems opening the Optifine installation file. Nevertheless, minimize our browser here, and Optifine's installed, guys. Looks like I've actually got to restart Minecraft to get this working correctly, and there we go. As you can see down at the bottom, there's Optifine. If we click this little green arrow, we've got the Optifine profile. If you don't have that, no worries. Just click the three bar right up here in the top right. Go to Launch Options, and then click on Optifine. Don't have that? Add a new profile. You can title it whatever you want. I'm just going to title mine Optifine. And then next to version in this drop-down box, find release 1.13-Optifine. Click on that click save go back over to the news tab and then again check to make sure the optifine profile is installed right there should also say optifine under the play button and click play now i've got to download some stuff and get minecraft set up because it's the first time optifine's been ran on this computer you'll probably have to download some stuff as well so i will see you guys right after a mighty quick jump cut right as this download is finishing and there we go just like that through the power of editing our download is finished and optifine is opening or minecraft's opening with optifine now we do have the BD Craft Texture Pack installed. No worries there. Don't freak out about it. We just have that installed. I'll turn it off for you guys here in a second as well, just to show you what is going on. But nevertheless, here we are. Look how beautiful BD Craft is. If we go into video settings, we can see all of the Optifine video settings there. You know, shaders, quality, everything is here. But let's go turn this resource pack off. Boom. And we'll be able to see that even without the resource pack, Optifine is in fact installed and running in Minecraft 1.13 on our Mac here. There's shaders. There's everything. It's installed, guys. All the awesome video settings that Optifine ads are here. Nevertheless, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And be sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. It really does mean the world to me. Thank you so much for watching. I am out, guys. Peace.